Hello and welcome back to European Renaissance 4. Now with the Wolf of Nations expansion and also got the uh what's this called? Conquest of Paradise, yeah. And this is Guess what? Unite and Conquer. Yay! Why should I divide and conquer or command and conquer? No. I want to unite and conquer. Unite all lands under my banner. Of war and death and die everything in this uh, Bordeaux red pink I don't know color I'm bad with color names who needs them you know the color I said so yeah um lots of changes had to wait till some fixes and I didn't notice there wasn't beta that fixes a lot of things oh then the relations oh this is gonna be painful now that costs. Diplo points to annex them. Anyway, vassals be annexed. What are you doing? Improving relations, fabricating claim. <sighs> yeah, that's the thing. Now it's the medieval era. <sighs> oh, great. It's going to take a while. Ooh, this music. Uh, I don't like how loud it is, and I don't want to get flagged. And yeah. anyway, um, ooh. still, um, okay. So Denmark, I can take them on. Holstein, sure, I can beat them. Moravia, mm, well, oh, having a fight, sure. Why not? Bam! Should be gaining some. Oh, it, if it sits at 30, I'll get a leader. Free leader, yay. Although they're all Western. Uh, great. So, ooh. oh yeah, Polish or accepted culture. Poland is an ally. Yep. Oh, Prussia is a vessel. Um, Oh yeah, Pomerania is an ally. Now, vassalization, oh, base tax, I guess it will take a while. What else has changed? I don't have the moonies. Wait, what? Um, let's recall. Great. Um, wait, what? Um, Ostrobusen, that's here. I guess something odd happened. Come on, let's see. Um, force limits. Oh yeah, that's why. Money. Pause. Income. Bam. Got income. Yeah. Right? Shitty income. Uh, give me more money. So Poland has Lendians, Moravia, and Hungary. Moravia, Hungary, and Lendians. Cool. Moravia, Poland. Yay. Great. Oh yeah, and the last unit then? Too many. Yeah. Uh, yep, discipline 95 because it's medieval era. Oh yeah, this mod. <laughs> it's actually fun. Yeah, I'm playing with the extended timeline mod. I love it actually because it lets me do stuff. Oh, annex. Um, a year 81, and it's the same with all of them. Well, pretty much. Eh. Ooh, cool. Oh, nice sound. I don't remember that one. Commonwealth. Yeah, it will take a while. Mm. At peace is not a subject. Zoya doesn't exist. Ah, we need Poland to exist. And I need Minsk, Kiev, and Turov. So those are here. Are Kiev. Minsk, 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 it's somewhere. 
close. Oh, new air. What is it? Uh, right. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Let's see, let's see. National Epic. Our subjects have taken to telling tales and legends about an old ruler. The legend says that in Lithuania's darkest hour, he will return to our nation and deliver it from evil. Regardless of the truth in that statement, we could use this in our propaganda. Hell yeah, propaganda. I've got the money. Some admin farms. Eh. And prestige. Who doesn't need prestige? So I got a ruler. He's good, he's 25, and my heir. Ah, he's decent, I guess. So, what's the plan? Actually, I don't know what the plan is. I would. Okay, let's see the decks. Oh, three years. Oh, yeah, I'm seeing one for tech up. You get infantry fire! And. Fabricate claims so I could conquer them. Mm -hmm. And I will just take them. Why would that vassalize them? And it's cheap to take these lands. Why wait? Why wait? Ah. Uh -huh. Fabricating claim on Lida. <gasps> Why oh you? Anyway. Mm. Tower. These lands. <laughs> oh well, anyway. Minsk. Wait. Did I miss Minsk right here? Ah, silly me. No mission. Okay. Uh, improve relations of old Prussia. That's old Prussia. Good. Oops. Prestige. Stability. Ooh. Now, if we go to war soon, we'll gain some prestige and stability is good. Yeah, let's take it. And I heard that... Uh, yeah, it's true. Once you cancel the mission now, it's only one year to... Ooh. To... Ooh. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Cool, why? Um, do I have ideas on it? No, it meant. Oh, these don't require anything. Oh, when you go to military tech, I mean, when you get to tech level 47, you change to the new policies, I think. Is it that bad? Yeah, just before this one. Technically, I could not, uh, I could just wait and not take any of these and take more of the modern ones, but it's good to have them. Three years, oh my. That changes everything. Right, mission. Prestige. So yeah, I'll be taking them. Probably, maybe, yeah, no? Sure, why not? Save up some money. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. <laughs> ah, this bloody hell. Can't I build anything? <sighs> Technology. When do we get these buildings? Eh. Yep. Ooh, decision. Eh. Eh. It's it's not an important decision. <gasps> Ooh. Now you same deck. And I've got a lot more prestige. All oh, right, you're. Allies, 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 Jagovich. It was now oh, these guys and they're weak. Weak. Actually, since they're more powerful and two to one. Four units. Six to three. Three and one. Seven. Six and seven, seven to be four, six to be two, eight, and that's one, one, three, two, oh, 
sure. Why not? Yeah, advisors don't know. I no. Hey, I can go on full maintenance. Better for me that. Okay, no, no. Let's actually save up some money before going to war, so that we can finish this fast. And while we're at it, we can actually fabricate more claims, just because it's cheaper to take the lands and end core them actually. So it'll be easier that way. <gasps> no, it'll take some time and. I love the points, but mm. Ooh, what's this? Whoa. No thanks. I don't think so. Yeah, there was oh yeah, policies. Now diplomats don't need trade efficiency, national trade income. I don't too much trade, yeah. Morale, colonial range. Ooh, colonial range, nice. Land leader shock, leaders without upkeep, but that's the same. I pay one, I just get leader shock as an extra. Ooh, morale and discipline. Now, I will be going to a lot of wars, probably. In no spending one point isn't that bad. No detecting is quite slow for now. National tax plus fifteen. Ooh. Oh yeah. Now I'm gaining most of my money from taxation, so a plus fifteen could make quite a difference for now. Missionaries don't need them, right? Yeah, what's the religious map? Well, oh, they're Slavic, but eh. Eh. Guess it's like, uh. You know. Do I need. Hmm. It's fine, I've got one. So, no. National work, revolt risk, I'm fine. Yeah, let's take this one. Policies! More moonies! So, yeah, cool. If I go to war, I have to spend some Diplo and Admin points. Ah, that's a lot of time, I can do it. Let's just wait for the, yeah, for the claim to be fabricated and then we can go to war finally. Ooh, aggressive expansion. <laughs> well, at least no one's joining the coalition yet. That would be bad, wouldn't it? Oh wait, Coronia, huh? Huh? Where's Coronia? Oh, they are in the coalition. That's why I'm taking them, I guess. Mm hmm. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, and about the is it better to vassalize and annex them later or? Just send us and then simply it costs 20 uh, admin points, I think, to core a province that. Yeah, but claims do decrease the cost. Yeah, it's 20, I think, and decreases by 25%, so that's like one fourth. That, oh, it's um, 15. And it takes 15 for one base tax, that's pretty much the same. Some time. Um, eh, don't need the military points. Like military points are one of the least used points. It's good to build up some of the buildings in your empire, but eh, you can live without them. 
Now, admin points are really useful st for stability. So, yeah. And building, like, uh, there was money making buildings, production and taxation. Yeah. And diplo points are useless, only for changing cultures. And that's not that needed, but although it's useful to change cultures, still. It's not as important. Trade. Actually, Pomeranian or Prussia are really strong. Well, yeah. Danzig plus 20. This one plus 10. Eh. Ooh. Harsh treatment. I wonder why. That's odd. Oh well. So, fabricate, fabricate, I wanna go to war. Fabricate, fabricate, I wanna go to war. And I will take this offensive policy because I don't need any military power. I will anyway take up and take a lot of time. Yeah. Exactly. The only important tech is actually military tech lag to westernize. And I shouldn't go too big. Ooh, 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 ooh. Monies. Uh, I left points. Lots of points. Lots and lots of points. Let's just increase maintenance completely. Oh, wait, we're, we're, we're done. Oh, my god. Oh, okay. Uh. Ooh, rebels! Ah. Well, they're screwed, I guess. Mm. Fine. Let's increase maintenance. Wait a couple of months. Oh, I don't want to fight those guys. They're nasty. Why should I fight the other rebels? Hmm. Hmm. Oh yeah, I've got lots of people to fight for me. <laughs> Forgot that. Vassals, come to help. No points. Okay, let's take the morale and discipline. Uh, yeah. Better morale and discipline is always good. And they don't have a leader, so one leader is enough. Like 10% morale and 5 discipline, that like counteracts all the negatives of uh, Middle Ages. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure, Mom. Uh, games and their questions. Well, it's good. You don't want to take policy accidentally and then have to keep it for 10 years. My god, 10 years. So, are we full? No, one more month. Oof. I'm gaining barely any points. <laughs> well, I don't have the income yet to take any more. Oh, look, you have military as if. Minus 21. Ooh. Um, so, yeah, let's go to war. Raj. So, um, actually, which one's... Mm, Memel. Let's go for Memel. Memel! I will be doing full annexation. But no, actually, I don't want you to come to this war. I want to take down it myself, I guess. Yeah. Hmm. Cause then they might siege something and then what's troublesome and they're not that strong, they can't defend against myself, so eh, no need no stinking allies. Oh my, did they not join? Ha huh? Well, I guess I'm going in. <laughs> That's great. Well, that was a waste. Well, not really. It's always best to. Whoa! That was 
freaking loud. Um, there we go. Or is it ambient? No, it's not. Okay, um, where are you going? I wonder. Oh, just there. And squish! You're done for. Ah, ooh, it's a seizure. Yeah, let's swap you. That monies. Monies. No. I'm losing shit tons of monies. That's siege. That's siege. No, actually. Oh, it's fine. Yeah. Oh, this is in the bag. <laughs> I is powerful. Oh, 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 call to arms. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> well, it's a defensive ball. Dragovich, Vietis. Wait, what? Vietis. It's Dragovich. Oh, Dragovich. Oh, Dragovich got invited, uh, got attacked by Vietis. And they invited Poland and they became the rule uh, controller. And they invited me. I guess. Kievan Lietes, Kievan Rus, and Lendians. Um, where's Kievan Rus? It should be somewhere close. I know that it should be close. There we go, Kievan Rus. So, Lietes, Kievan Rus, and Lendians. Ah. Uh. Wait, what? Ledger. Relations. Current wars. Lithuanian conquest. Vietes. Yeah. Poland. Dragovich against Lendians. Kiev and Rus and Vietes. Oh, Latgavia didn't join. Ah. Uh, fine, I guess. So it's this one. Yeah. Ooh. Oh wait, oh yeah, I mean my vassals. Haha. <laughs> I like brought in a huge army. Right. Ooh, leader. I don't have a leader. He's there sitting. You know? Um I'll just sit there. Let my vassals fight. <laughs> Menden. Oh no, don't, don't you dare go there. Yeah. yeah. Would be great to leave him siege. But he's good at fighting too, so I need him. Um, yeah, attach actually. I want you to attach to this unit. I want a big deadly stack and go squish them. Ah, uh, Grodno, 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 where's Grodno? Oh, there it is. Let's go there then. Ah, damn it. Shocking. I want to catch them like this. No. Come on. Can I catch them? Ninth, tenth. Oh, they've got a faster one. No. Damn it. Well, I can't help there. If I can catch the Lendians. Ooh, ooh, yeah, yeah! Oh, great. Well, they can't win this one, can they? Ooh, yes, come in to help. That's are expensive for God's sake. Oh, fudge. I actually lost that one.
Hmm. Bloody hell. Good, at least we won this battle. Um... Should be fine. Yep. Yeah, you go crush that. Oh. So they will get on 15th and oh. And then. And then. Now they're going. Ah, oh, they're still going to Vilna. You really want to get a crossing? Oh my, they've got a lot of morale. Discipline. Whoa, their discipline is high. Why is it? Preserve our troops. Okay, I don't want to listen to the fighting, it's too loud. Yeah, we've got them. Still. Ooh, that was nasty. Oh, game options. Better have no sound than get too loud of sound. Come on, move. I want to crush them. Actually, though with eight based, I want Mansk. Ah, <gasps> you know what? Ah, uh, I can't. And it's it's my side. <laughs> Oh, silly me. Oh, uh, yeah, Lendians. Can I take anything from these guys? Kiev is too far away. Um, this is being sieged already. No, actually, there's nothing I can take. Too bad, too bad. I would l love to take something. Hmm. Well, then go have fun or something. I don't care anymore. 50 men? Yeah. Let's send in some more. Uh, the leader. Should be fine. Yay, war. Say no to peace. <laughs> oh, look. I can deck up. Ah, I want the points recording actually just in case now monies 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 ooh 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 ah ha ha ooh. during a recent recent challenging tournament and Unheralded commoners surprised all in attendance by vesting everyone who faced him until he was declared the champion. Now we face the awkward decision of what to do if the man must lead our troops. Well, people don't like it, I guess, because he's just a commoner, though he's good at it. Some loss of legitimacy would lead to decreased, increased revoltress, uh, income bats. Actually, it's not that important. Prestige. Ah, prestige. Damn it, I want prestige, but a general with 100 tradition? That's so good. And he will live for at least 10 years, so I can take some lands in that time. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, he's not that good, actually. Ooh, uh, oh, it's only one time less. Arrivals. <laughs> Yay, no military power at all. Yeah, because that guy's got a besieger. Hmm, damn it. What can we do? Poland, Poland, Poland. Oh, Poland. Well, Brest would be nice, though. Hmm. There's nothing I can do. Actually, really. 
Well, I could take care of those rubble. No. Let's just sit tight. Ooh, money. Ah, money. It's reinforcing. No, it's not too bad now. Not too bad. Hmm. Still, the income is. Shit. This is taking its time. Let's increase the speed to four. Yay, my CPU can't handle it. I don't know. I wonder. Because the frame rate is bad. Let's just say the frame rate is bad. Uh, I wish I had cannons. So we're just gaining. Uh, yeah, mostly that. Well, the sieges. Yeah, sieges are happening. Oh, finally. Thank you. Four years and I can annex them. Ah, Pomerania. Lendians. Lendians are these guys. Wait, they no, they didn't seed anything, did they? No. That's all mine. Uh, that's still them. So they just approved, accepted defeat, I guess. Phew. So that's Kion Rus and we got Viatis Viatis H. There's no way of pronouncing that H, even in my language. Ugh. Stupid H. H is a difficult s syllable? I don't know. Sound. Hush, hush, H. Ha ha ha. He he. Haha. Via Terus. It could. No, it would be the other way around. Mm. I wonder. Seed. Ah, uh, yeah, full annexation. Need all of the power. 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 All the lands, I mean. You need all the lands to. Full seed. Uh, full annex them. Right. And actually, I think once this war is over, I will start cores, check my status, and whoo, zero. And it will be it for the episode because it's been going on long enough. And the frame rate is shit! I wonder why. Come on. Oh, yeah. So, full annexation. Mm mm. Lots of aggressive expansion. Oh, they will hate me. Well, Coronia won't exist anymore. Latgalia. And then Lendians, plus 20. So, uh, that's them. Oh, it's fine. What's the worst that could happen? Right? Coalition? Like that ever happens. Bam! Now to war exhaustion. No, it's not too much. Base twenty, base tax control, so that's forty plus twenty five percent. Yep. It's fine. Memel. Don't you get a discount? Yeah. Have a claim. Huh. Oh yeah, and it's six. Oh, Kurland. Yeah, it's the capital. I didn't have a claim on it. Now the Revoltrisk is. Ugh. Hi. <laughs> we can duck up then. Oh, look. Exactly zero. And stand on Kurland, I guess. Yeah. Easier to reach. And wait out for that war to end. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I don't care. Yeah. 
Hmm. Nationalism. Oh, hmm. That didn't show up before. I wonder why. Oh, tribal despotism. And I'm a feudal monarchy. Haha. <laughs> oh. Oh, 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 oh. Kingdom, tribal federation. A feudal monarchy. Yeah, ah, that's interesting. So, how's my orcs? Ah, it's not too bad. Oh, so yeah, they entered the military coalition against me. Now then, income. Good. I'm making money. That's really good. Subjects. Let me. Yeah, oh. Uh, well, what would you expect? Such high interest. I should just stamp them. 30 power, it's not too much. 20 and 10, that's only 60. I, I wanted to do something important. Just like now. See? 45, that's like for. Yeah, 45 years. 450. Alright, I will want to annex them, and for that I need to improve relations. 2 plus 200, and yeah, it's fine. We can do it. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. Ah. Uh, no reinforcements. My income. Uh, <laughs> Although the corn is fast, so that's that's good. Now, this war. Poland, yeah. Vilna? No. Oh, yeah. Mm. Importing iron. We strive to Okay. We strive to keep the Lithuanian military strong, modern and domestically supported, but sometimes our priorities end up in conflict with each other. Lacking the rich iron mines of our neighbors, some of our grander plans for future military development will not be possible as soon as we might wish. Increasing imports in that is a tempting opinion option. But relying on foreign support might compromise our trade policies, although a knife in the back of our neighbor would be all the more brilliantly insidious if made from their own steel. So, yeah, buy their steel, make a knife and stab them. So I could gain more military power and some relations with them. Or just gain to mercantilism. I go for mercantilism. Mercantilism? Mercantilism? Ah, I don't know. Baltic Sea. Come on. Hey. I forgot about that. Trade map mode. So this one's probably too far. Yeah. This one shouldn't be. Ooh. Not card yet. That's why I never sent any. They're all too far. Hey, but at least now I have a lot more. Power? No. No. Damn it. Oh, uh, because my capital is doing that and I'm collecting trade in this mode. And I don't have much power. And total worth is uh, it's actually pretty much the same. Mm. Maybe I should move my capital. Oh right. Trade capital. Yeah. There's that new thing, trade capital. <gasps> oh right, rivals. Um Oh right, uh war still at war. Ah oh, damn it, come on, stop the war. It's annoying. Old Prussia going to war. Uh, ooh, are they going to lose a fight? Fine, I'll go help. I wanna end this. The war, the war. Good maneuver. Maneuver. <laughs> maneuver. 
Ooh, minus two, that's bad, but well, he's a good leader. It's compensation for pet territory. Scorch that. Boom. And let's. Oh my income! Wow, it's huge now. What happened? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. One drop by one. Uh, and I here was thinking why my economy got better. Nope. Come on, end the war. I've got inflation reduction, so let's take the power. Power is good. Okay, this war is not ending. But yeah, the plans are good, and Lengali is the only one in the coalition against me, so I can just take them out next time. And I guess this is it for now, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.